Hey guys, how's it going? In this video, I'm going to walk through this legal problem, a design parking system. Uh, so this question was asked by Amazon for 12 times for the past six months. Uh, so let's dive in. Um, so this is an object-oriented design problem. Uh, let's take a look at the example here. I think it's yeah, easy to understand the wording over here. And first, we initialize the object by calling uh, uh, the parking system. And then we pass in uh, the a list of numbers as an argument. So the first number is the num is a number of uh, parking spot for the uh, the big size parking spot, and the second number is the medium size parking spot. The number so in this case we have a uh, one medium size parking spot and also one big size parking spot, and we have no small size. And then we can um, call a function. Add car, and also by uh, passing a, a car type. So one uh, meaning it's, it's a big car, and uh, two refers to the uh, medium car, and three referring to the small car. So, uh, so the first car, which is a big car, can take up the spot because we have a one spot assigned as a um, a big size. And also the second car is can be satisfied because we also have a one spot for the medium car. However, the last one, which is small car, and we don't have any spot for the medium address for the small car. So that returns a false. And we return a two for the first two spots. And the last one, uh, we also have a big car, but unfortunately, uh, there's no spot for that car anymore because that spot has been taken by the first car we, that we come across. So uh, let's implement the object together. So first we initialize a dictionary. I call it self.lot. And the initialization, look at uh, how many spots are available for each of the sizes. So big size, medium size, and small size. And uh, the key is the size. And the value is the number of spots is available. One meaning uh, is for the big size. Two is a medium size, three is a small size, and this is how many spots is available. And then whenever we add a car, um, if the car type, type uh, the car type that passed in is not in the dictionary, so we immediately return the false, else, and then we check the availability. If we have more than one spot available, and then we decrease the the available spots by one because that spot will be taken by uh, one of the spots will be taken by that car and then also at the same time we return a two so um this is about it uh so this for this easy type question i hope you enjoyed it uh if this is helpful please help uh like and subscribe that would be huge support thank you so much for watching i will see you next video